Okay. Hi, I'm David Warsinger, and I'm going to be going over BibText for Award, a citation software. The learning objectives are for everyone to be able to use the, the software, and also to be aware of how to install it and the finer complexities of it, such as styles and citations. So the basics for BibText for Word is a panel that you add into Word itself that has several different options. The main one we're going to be using is just Cite. The others you don't need to access quite as much. So as an example, once you've installed it, you get this panel up at top, on the top that will be added to Word as an add in at the very end. So if you click on the Add Citation and you want to add something, so this dialog box will pop up, and then you have some keyword that links to your BibText file, you type that in, you hit OK, and then ta-da, it appears at the end. So citing is very, very fast with this, and it is good for group projects where most people use Word or aren't comfortable with LaTeX and some of the other alternatives. Uh, and it's fairly easy to install. So as an example of how to find the citations themselves, right? my favorite method is through Google Scholar. With, let's say we type something in. I chose dinosaur thermal constraints because I think that's cool and I have side projects on that. Uh, go to Google Scholar. Then you hit the cite button once it comes up. This dialog will appear in the big BibTeX option. And then you get a citation for BibTeX. You can just copy and paste this see into a Word doc that has your cite or a notepad document and has your citations, or you can put it into a more formal reference document. And that's it. So once you cite this tag in that dialog box, it'll automatically cite. And using Google Scholar is way quicker than ScienceDirect, I think, for finding the BibTeX formatting. And um, for some more advanced options, if you want to control how things look with the style, um, you can go to the Style tab, which would, is in the Word. You just click on this. And you have your typical style. There's a few options you can see from the list. This one's good for some engineering papers. And you can add different symbols to it to enhance or control the style. So adding the caret makes the citation, instead of being bracketed, being up top is a superscript. And then um, I think the S makes things ordered. Uh, and there's some other commands. And then there's a detailed list of commands here. You can find all mine as well. Um, is it. If you want to install, um, you can just search the text for a word. And you're, there's a bunch of install steps. Typically, most people only need to do four through seven because it's kind of complicated. And that is it.